Hi, today we're going to talk about parallel universes. Parallel universe is a multiverse theory where alternative realities or universes exist parallel to each other in different dimensions in our reality. In our reality, we have three dimensions in space, length, width, depth, and a fourth dimension of time, as Einstein revealed. In the quantum multiverse, there are more dimensions that exist. According to string theory, the universe operates in ten dimensions. These theories of parallel dimensions aligned together are not a problem, but a solution. The mind and body function in different parallel micro-universes that are aligned because anything that happens in the mental realm affects the physical universe, the body. Therefore, in the parallel, parallel universe, what exists in our reality resonates in another dimension or reality also. In quantum mechanics, the multiple states or possibilities exi exist for the quantum or tiny particles at the same time. All the possible rotations and vibrations are enclosed as possibilities in a wave function at the same time. Although they all exist in the wave, when we observe them with our limited physical tools, we see only one state as the wave function collapses into one reality. Leonardo da Vinci said, Learn how to see. Realize that everything connects to everything else. Everything is connected as our struggles to get free and our hardships are connected and prepare us for our next dimension. Everything happens for a reason and it is all weaved into a tapestry of pictures and designs uh, where no thread can be pulled without destroying the whole fabric. There is no division so separateness is an illusion as all parallel universes are connected by di with diagonal or perpendicular paths, united in one consciousness. Parallel to our life, there are other dimensions, but we can't experience them unless we are, are willing to expand our reality to include them. Spiritual experience, uh, experiences deepen our meaning because we see the universe unfolding, connected to everything. Not only are we in the universe, the universe is in us. We climb mountains not to be seen to plant our flag, but to push through struggles to get high and enjoy the view because we reach another dimension. Our dreams are another dimension, giving us a momentary glance into the parallel universe. Carlos Castaneda wrote, Dreaming is the vehicle that brings dreamers to this world. The emissary said, and everything, everything sorcerers know about dreaming was taught to, the, to them by us. Our world is connected to yours by a door called dreams. We know how to go through the door, but men don't. They have to learn. It is easy to slip into another dimension in the parallel universe. There are so many dimensions, mental, spiritual, and physical. People take psychedelics to shock themselves into a temporary glimpse of another dimension. With mescaline, LSD, psilocybin, and other psychedelics. But it is not permanent. These realms of existence and experience are very different from what common humans are to go because they are different realities. The common person puts up obstacles to the spiritual experience with emotions like anger, anxiety, and past memories that are disturbing. Others have attachments that anchor them to the physical world with inner memories that are good or bad. The ego is a big anchor that holds us down to lower stages of life. But don't worry, after enough trauma, we learn to go beyond it and the mind. Sadhguru says, The significance of a mystic is that he has opened dimensions that are not accessible through the mental process. Mahabhagavati says, Quiet the mind and the soul will speak. In Christianity, we climb Jacob's ladder, which is a way... Uh, from earth 
through, the, through different dimensions to heaven. In Jewish religion, they had the Torah as a connection from earth to heaven. We are the parallel universe, multiverse that contains all the dimensions within us because we are a consciousness beyond our mind and body that encompasses it. To live in the spiritual dimensions is our true reality that flows with stillness. So when we are engulfed in stillness and in peace, the different facets of spirituality flow through us. It starts and flows with stillness. So we become aware of consciousness and the different levels that, that create creativity comes from because it is a more expand because it is more expanded than our mind. Being mindful in the present moment is what opens the portal to the spiritual dimensions that flow through our life. In consciousness, the intervals of time and space are a hallucination because everything is happening and existing at the same time. In our mind, we see what we want to see, and our mind is tuned to that frequency or vibration. When we change our thoughts, we change our, the frequency and see a different part of reality. Therefore, observing from the mind, we see things happening one thing after another. But in consciousness, everything is happening in the present. Einstein and quantum science tells us that everything is happening now. The stars that are light years away from us may be dead now, but we see their light now because it took years to reach us. This means the mistakes in our past are lessons leading to our future. That is now connected to our past. Rumi saw this unity and asked the question, Are and you, when will you begin the long journey into your self? Star Trek and Marvel Comics and their corresponding movies go beyond the normal timeline to express multiple and parallel universes all happening at once. These mind-bending movies suggest that there are more dimensions in reality than what our mind can imagine, what quantum calls possibilities. Everything is happening at once, so the future already exists, where our future self becomes and has what we long for. It is a matter of entering the frequency of who we are deep within and knowing we already exist in that dream or reality. If there is a delay, it is because we need a few more lessons to get inner peace, to harmonize with the frequency and learn that we are already who we want to be. Nikola Tesla said, If you want the secrets of the universe, Think in terms of energy, frequency, and vibration. Paramahansa Yogananda said, Possession of material riches without inner peace is like dying of thirst while bathing in a lake. Thank you.